All right, it's time. We're gonna do a cardio five today. And cardio five is just gonna pick it up a little bit of a notch up from the cardio four. And we're gonna do uh, 60 seconds at a time this time. So it's gotta be uh, four exercises doubled each 60 seconds. Um, I'm gonna time them for uh, no breaking at all. We're switching over uh, right after we get each one of them done and just keep going for eight minutes solid. You should get your heart rate up pretty high. And as I said before, if you want to double up, you can double up, do this, take a minute break, recover and do it again. I'm gonna do two rounds to show you how it works. I'm getting something out of it, so you should be able to. And um, we're just gonna hustle it through, okay? So here we go. We're gonna start off with 60 seconds worth of jabs. So we're gonna jab solid. Non-stop, 60 seconds. You can switch them up if you want to sometimes. Go twos, go twos, go twos. Keep going twos, then you can go doubles. Whatever you feel like you want to do, you can mix it up, keep it exciting. Um, after that, we're going to do um, a dumbbell swing. So we're going to use whatever you want to use. Start out at eight pounds, and then you can take it up to, uh, I'm going to use 15 pounds. So you can use go as high as 15. It's a swing, not a lift. So you don't want to lift the dumbbell. You want to grab the dumbbell, one of these, and you want to go a squat, your hands out, and you're swinging the dumbbell up. Tuck your hips in and get the dumbbell to get way up. That's how you swing it. All right? No lifting. You want to swing the dumbbell. So that's going to be um, the jabs, 60 seconds, dumbbell swing, and the right hand for 60 seconds. We're going to do uh, um, speed skaters, back and forth. They're going to look like this. For 60 seconds, then after that, we're gonna go back on the other side, the left hand, and do the dumbbell swings. And that's gonna give us four minutes, and we're gonna double that around, and it's gonna give us twice. You ready? Let's make it happen. So first thing is gonna be the jabs, and that's gonna last us for 60 seconds, and we're gonna do the dumbbell swing. Here we go, time. All right, here we go. Remember, 60 seconds, so you can switch them up if you want. You can go two, you can go two if you want, you can go really intense. And as the time cuts back, you can peel back a little bit, or you can just keep going. But it's 60 seconds, whatever you do, it's 60 seconds. If you want to get out funky with it, you can go ahead, you can do uppercuts. <sighs> whatever you want to do. But right now, I'm going to keep them simple. The jabs, right here, for 60 seconds. Just trying to get my heart rate up. As you can see, I'm switching up the legs, just to kind of give a little bit of some, some funky stuff. And Make sure you use your midsection turn. Turn and fire those punches like you mean them. Get them up there like you mean them. By the time you're done, your heart rate should be up. 60 seconds. Do whatever you can. Take little tiny breaks so you can get the intensity up high. All right, there you go. Right hand on the dumbbell swing. Here we go. Tuck the dumbbell up in the air. Keep the hand out. If you keep your hands out, you're going to make sure that you're using all those muscles. I'm not compromising the move. No leaning forward. You want to make sure that you're swinging the dumbbell up. Superman pose with the dumbbell. Don't get it too high. 60 seconds. That's number one. Push. You can take the dumbbell up to whatever weight you want it to be, but it's the actual motion. The water don't try to make it too heavy. When you get down and get your swing, get a little bit of a squat. Get the dumbbell in there and swing them up. Shoot them up. Here we go. Dumbbells off to the side. Here we go. Speed skaters. Get it behind you. Jump over. Get them back. If you want to, you can let them touch. Or you can just run them over. Push them to the side. And back to the other side. Yeah. Nice big jumps. Six 
this is that to be a back row right when you do this. Yes. The skate is right there. Here we go, next hand. Dumbbell. Dumbbell swings. You just gotta tone it down for whatever you can handle. You don't want the hands up there, you keep the hands right here. Swing them up. That's it. That's how it's like a Here we go, Jack. Mid-section, moving back and forth. Ah, uppercut. Whatever you want to do, mix it up. Keep it all nice and spicy. Let's go. Make you want to keep doing it every day. It's a little easy, but you try them out. No matter who you are, you try and you'll see. Heart rate going high, eight minutes up. Imagine if you had weights with this. Swing. There you go, that's your jab. Dumbbell swings. Right side. Swing them up. Get down, let them swing between the legs, and pump them up. We'll never skip. Pump them up. Tuck the hips in, and I'll get the hands to go up. Don't attempt to lift them up. Dumbbell's too heavy for lifting. You want to get them swung. It's cardio driven. That's why you want to swing them. Different variations, hands are out. You can put the hands down to the back. Or you can just lay them right on the side. Right here. 60 seconds each. There you go. Woo! I'm out. There we go. Skaters. You can jump as far as you want, you can take it further, all the way up, or you can take it close, whatever you want to do. You try them out, and you tell me it's easy. Yeah, swing them up, tuck it in. Twenty-three seconds. Yeah. Yeah, 12 seconds. Three seconds. Yeah. 
Yeah, you gotta be quiet. Yeah. Eight minutes. 60 seconds. Four times. And repeat it again. 60 seconds. Four times. Cardio five. Don't take it for granted. But that's what you need to do to get all the body fat melted. And then from there, you start pumping up, making some muscles out of it. Cardio five, I'm out.